Hey guys, Michael from Copper vs Glass, and today we've got another top icon packs for Android. So, let's take a look. So first up we have Alexis. Now with this icon pack you're going to get around 3639 icons at the moment with around 106 cloud wallpapers. The icons themselves are all bright, very bold and they've all got the same shape which I really like with an icon pack because it gives it some sort of uniformity over the actual OS itself. You do however have some colours that you wouldn't normally see within an icon pack. So for instance with Chrome it's made up mainly of green, yellow and also a kind of pinkish red which is a little bit unusual for something like that. However it's like that with a lot of the icons as well, all of the colours are very exaggerated, however that's something I actually like. Next up and my favourite on the list has to be the Dark Matter icon pack with around 2800 icons and 108 cloud wallpapers. Now this one here has a very unique design to it and it's also a very clean icon pack. You've got some very nice bold colours, however everything is outlined in black which I think really makes them pop, especially on an AMOLED screen. Next up and a personal favourite of mine has to be the re one icon pack. Now this has over 4000 icons and over 50 wallpapers. Now the reason why I like it is it takes you back to the material design days. As you can see everything looks exactly as you'd expect it to on Android, there's no weird shapes or anything or weird colours. It's definitely Definitely a material design icon pack that I think can look good with pretty much any setter. And then lastly we have the squared icon pack, now it doesn't have too many icons with just over 1224 wallpapers but as you can see here if you are going for a very desaturated pastel look then this is definitely the icon pack to go for. It's got a really unique design to it with all the icons being square and also with those desaturated colours it does look really nice however I would definitely go for a wallpaper that matches. Now for me I would really pair this up with a black and white wallpaper or again something that's mainly one solid colour to really make the icon shine. Something that I'm beginning to see more and more is actually a completely redesigned interface for icon packs. As you can see here you can easily go between icons, wallpapers, applying it to your launcher and also requesting any icons that may not be skinned and in my opinion it's definitely a step up from what we used to have with icon packs and just in general the layout that we used to have beforehand. And that's going to do it guys for this video. All the icon packs that I've mentioned in today's video will be linked in the description down below. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up down below. If you've got any questions, comments, or any more icon packs, widgets, launchers, or anything to do with Android that you want me to take a look at, then let me know in the comments section or on Twitter at Copper vs Glass. We've also just hit over 60,000 subscribers here on the channel and if you're not already subscribed now is a great time to do so and also turn on notifications if you haven't already so that you're notified any time that I post a new video. I'm Michael from Copper vs Glass, thanks very much for watching and I will catch you guys in the next video.